Hello there, everybody. My name is Jerry Joe, and welcome to the game Ligophobia. This is demo three? Three, I'm pretty sure. It's a game starring me. Me. That's the green eyed dude. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah. And I yell at my wife a lot. It's a fun game, trust me. Alrighty. Okay, something bad just happened. Okay, there we go. Sorry, I had to click on the screen. Many secrets reside in the darkest corners of our rooms. Should I say that I'm afraid of the dark or what's hidden within it? Maybe I just fear what the darkness represents, a black hole filled with broken promises and forgotten memories. An unknown world where the only limit is a person's imagination. You spend your whole life looking for an answer in the dark, but what happens in the dark comes searching for you! Jeremy Miles. Day one, afternoon. Why the hell do I even bother? I can't write a novel in the state I'm in. I've been having the same nightmare for the past two weeks. I don't even want to sleep anymore. Oh my god, that Leon Kennedy jacket! Sorry that I didn't knock, but I've been worried about you. Why haven't you been answering any of my calls? I just want to be alone for a while. These last few weeks haven't been kind to me. Just tell me what's been bothering you. You should talk about your problems with other people. I can deal with my own problems. It's not like anyone would understand me anyways. If this is about your phobia, calm or aggressive, we're gonna be nice. It's not about that at all. I've been having the same nightmare every night. Nightmare? What was it about? In the dream, I awoke in my old bedroom that I had when I was a kid. The whole room was shrouded in darkness. The darkness seemed to move like it had a mind of its own. I was overcome with fear and I couldn't move at all. Did something attack you in the dream? I'm not exactly sure. I... I always wake up sweating and breathing heavily. Maybe you have some repressed memories. You could, you could go see someone for that. You mean therapy? I know I'm not the pinnacle of mental health, but I don't need to see anyone about this. I hope you're right, Jeremy. Would you mind if we continued this conversation tomorrow? I need to head over to the supermarket and pick up a few things. That's fine with me. I hope this is all over soon and we can spend some quality time together. Oh, hell yeah, Barbara! I would love that! I'm happy as shit! The sanity meter. The meter that pops up in the upper left corner determines Jeremy's current mental health or mental state. It will appear every time the player makes a choice or performs certain actions. These choices and actions will have positive or negative, negative effects on Jeremy's current mental state. Certain dialogue and choices will change accordingly. Man! Now that having Jeremy's sanity at suicidal or below could possibly lead to his death or worse, try your best, try your best to stay sane. There are plenty of choices in Lagophobia, but not all of them will lead to the desired outcome. Try not to get anyone killed. Should probably head to the supermarket and pick up a few things. I see that you added a lot. This is by Dead Dove Productions. Um, if you remember a game called Ripest of Fears that Markiplier played, I also played it, but mainly Markiplier played. It was meant for him. Maybe things are finally starting to change back to normal. It's by the creator of that game. So, I have high hopes for this. And this music is so epic right now. I have a box in my room. It's hard to believe that I kept all these toys from my childhood. I guess it's part of me I can't let go. Probably have like some magic or Yu-Gi-Oh cards in there and then I'd be like, why do I have these? Oh yeah, because they're worth like $500. Ha! <laughs> Uh, the door is locked. There's no reason for me to enter my neighbor's house anyway. You don't know that. Is that Mark? The door is locked. What are you doing? This isn't your apartment. Oh, sorry about that. I must be a little confused. How's it going, Mark? Markiplier, everyone. <laughs> I'm doing fine. My job hasn't been going great for me the, past, the last few months. Why are you standing out in the rain? I usually come outside to think, but the weather has been horrible the last few weeks. The rain isn't so bad when you get used to it. It was nice talking to you, Mark. I'll see you later. I love you, Mark. I love you. I was gonna say that's the supermarket right there. No. So now we live in an apartment. I swear that I had my wallet in my back pocket. Afraid that I can't help you with that. You'll just have to leave and come back some other time. Damn it, how could I forget that? Ah! It's that damn dog again. He's been roaming around outside all week. Do me a favor and take him out with you. He's probably just looking for a place to stay. The weather's been rough this week. His eyes seemed. Aww. He looks really depressed. I wonder if his collar can tell me anything. You examine his collar. He bites the shit out of you. Ah! It seems to be blank. I wonder why this dog was roaming around with a collar and no name. The dog begins to wag his tail wildly. 
Do you want to come home with me? I don't have much, but I'll share with <laughs> what I have with you. The dog nods his head in approval. What a smart-ass dog. He's coming home with me. Shadow, that's actually one of my friend's dog's <coughs> name. Or my cousin. That awkward moment when you forget whose dog's name is Sh No, nope, my friend Willie. Willie. <laughs> the dog appears to like his new name. Well, I guess it's settled then. Let's go home, Shadow. Sorry, Willie. Forgot Shadow's name. If you're watching. Awkward. Christian Rivers? I'm glad you're here, Detective Rivers. We have two people that were brutally stabbed to death. They have been identified as Jim and Sarah Parker. I remember that! I believe. Just when I thought this week couldn't get any worse. Is there anything else I should know? The victims had a daughter. She is the one that found them like this. You should ask her a few questions. Suppose I could sure uh, she's probably still in shock from finding her parents like this. I don't know how much help she will be right now. Do you think this is related to the girl we found dead in the street a couple weeks back? I'm not really sure. She was identified as an 8-year-old girl that disappeared 16 years ago from the town of Springfall. It's odd that she turned up here in Blackford, and now that there's been two additional murders, I'll make a connection when I have more information. I'm seriously going to need a drink after this. You sure that's a good idea? The murder case isn't going to be so <laughs> going to solve itself. Was I talking to you, man? Alright, I'll just start off with a cocktail, smirky ass face. Is there anything else you want to tell me? No, sir. Damn right I'm, sir. You must be the new guy. I didn't even talk to you, Jenkins. You... Fuck off. I'm joking. Jenkins is probably a nice guy. It's an honor to meet you, Detective Rivers. Don't try and butter me up unless you're gonna take me out on a date. Is it true that you found the missing girl from Stringfall? Did you know her? I didn't know her personally, but I have a cousin that's from the same town as her. I don't think that helps me here. I need to have a look around. During an investigation, we'll be able to talk to certain people, examine certain things to find clues. These clues will open new choices and change how it plays out. Examine the body. Her shirt appears to be torn and there are several stab wounds on her back. She's probably tried to get away from the killer. I wonder why her, bo why her body is over here and not closer to the door. There's an odd symbol on the wall. Oh yeah. <laughs> I just thought it was a blood splatter. I've never seen anything like that. The murderer might be part of a cult and this was a ritualistic sacrifice. Give me more, give me more! Like, does he ever cry? Looks like someone was preparing a meal before this happened. Nothing? Nothing else? Huh? Come on, you can talk to me. Or not. Are you done with your inv- Fuck no! <laughs> Are you done with your investigation, dude? I just started my investigation. Oh, let's go in the other room. Fuck that bitch. I'm sorry. Her parents were just kidding. Oh, that's a cop! I was like, who the hell? I'm glad that you're here, Detective Rivers. Glad that you're here too, bald man. Oh, shit. Oh! I think I remember him. There doesn't seem to be any sign of the straw. I played a, a mini, like, add-on to this game a while back. The killer could have surprised them, but that seems unlikely. I wish I knew what the symbol means. Maybe I should look into it a bit more. How? Well, there's a bookshelf. There's anything of interest here. Doubt there's anything of interest there. Alright, come on. Show me the money. Oh, bathroom. Okay, yeah, I didn't think anything would be in there. Damn! That's the end of the house. It tricked me. Did you move? No. Hello, I'm Detective Rivers, and I need to ask you a few questions. Barbara? No. Barbara's parents were murdered? No, my wife? My girl? I still haven't processed that my parents are gone. Pressure? <laughs> hey, bitch, I need some answers! I know that it must be difficult for you, but I need your help. Please let me ask you a few questions. Alright, I'll try to help as much as I can. Ask about her parents. Did anyone have a grudge against your parents? My parents were liked by everybody. I can't imagine someone wanting them dead. When was the last time you talked to your parents? I called my mother a few days before this happened. It didn't seem like anything was wrong. Well, I guess that doesn't help much. Was there something else you wanted to ask? Well, the only other thing. Does the town of Springfall mean anything to you? It's actually where I grew up. Why do you ask? Well, there was another murder before this one, and she was from the same town. So it's somehow connected? I don't know for sure, but I'm going to look into it. Do you know anyone from Springfall that moved to Blackford? My boyfriend, Jeremy, is from Blackford. He wasn't bo- Am I the murderer? But he lived there for about six years. Do you think he's in danger? Sure, there's nothing to worry about. I hope you're right. Was there something else that you wanted to ask? Thank you for answering my questions. <laughs> Not no, just... Yeah, I'm done. Wait a minute. 
I'll look around a little more. I like the calm, relaxing music of what after what just happened. Do you have anything to say? I'm glad you're here. Well, you're very reassuring. I'm glad you're glad I'm here. I need to figure shit out. Okay, I think I'm done. I'm definitely done. Yes. Yeah, I've seen enough. Is there anything you wanted to look into further? Where do we begin? Um, let's go with the symbol. I need to figure out what that symbol means. It might give us an idea of who we're dealing with here. I'll look into it right away. Let's get the hell out of here. That's kind of fucked up. My girl got her parents murdered and you're just trying to get the hell out of there? Ooh, damn. Back to germs. I guess it's about time that we've been to bed, Shadow. You pet Shadow on the head. Staying up is an option too. I doubt that I could sleep that long. Shadow awaits your decision. Let us sleep, Shadow. Let us sleep. I can't sleep. I feel like something is watching me. Oh no, it's me as a child. I have such cute pajamas. Maybe mom and dad will let me sleep in their room again. I never did that. <laughs> I never did that as a child. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't still do that. What? Why is my... Stay away from me! Hello there, weird-headed kid! Come on, open up! Oh, it opened up. Okay. Oh, no. Where am I? Why did my room lead out here? Thank you for letting... <laughs> Thank you for that, because I totally forgot that there was a save. Thanks for the autosave. Oh, this is not a lot of light. Okay. I sort of remember... This area! Little boy Jeremy got murdered. I like how it says play movie, by the way. That's that's nice. I like that. Makes me feel like I'm doing something way more awesome. Oh, fuck! God damn it! I heard it, but I was like, oh, nothing's chasing me. I'm fine. This might take a while. I I suck. And die a lot, as people may know. No, nope, 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 nope. The door seems to be locked. Oh, fuck me. Just when you thought it couldn't get any fucking worse. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. Do I have a flashlight? I need to check. No way to increase the light radius here. Can I maybe like... No. Nope. No way. Okay. Okay. Oh! 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 No one saw that. No one saw that. There's a statue here. Thanks, statue. I don't know. Found a key. Fuck. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Oh! Jesus. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. in, in. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in, in, in. Thank God. I'm in. Ooh, sup? Are you okay? Why did they do this to me? I don't know, Amy. Why did they do this to you? You're covered in blood. Nice observation, Jeremy. You get him. You did this to me, Jeremy. Amy, I'd hate to break it to you. I'm a child and I don't even know you. What are you talking about? I don't know who you are. YOU WILL FEAR MY PAIN! WHY DON'T YOU REMEMBER? Cause I'm a fucking kid, I don't know! <laughs> you can't do that to me. You can't do that to me. You can't do that to me. Alright. I don't know if there was other stuff. But I'm really excited for this now. Just seeing all the things that could happen has got me excited. And I it just looks like a very well made game from all the demos and little extras that I've played. So thank you very much to Dead Projection. I can't even talk. I can't even talk. Actually let me skip ahead really quick. Let me see. Let me see if I could um stay up and see what happens. Alright, back to night one. Alright, Shadow. We're about to stay the fuck up. Let's just stay awake for tonight. Shadow seems happy to hear that. Oh, at least Shadow. Who'd be knocking at this time of night? Something seems to be bothering Shadow. Something wrong, Shadow? Can't tell what's wrong with it. <laughs> that fucking face, he's like, Motherfucker, you shouldn't answer that. You'd stay here while I... Son of a bitch, what happened to the lights? Oh no, where's Shadow? Oh, he's in the corner. Oh my god, that face! Oh, nope, nope, that's a shadow note face. Don't worry, shadow, the paddle will be back on in no time. Right? Right. Of course it will be. I'm gonna go see who's knocking. Did that come from the bathroom? Probably. 
bad shit usually happens in the bathroom. Oh no, it's the symbol! What the hell is going on here? The mirror doesn't seem to be broken, but I know I heard the glass breaking. I feel like there's something in there. <coughs> Who was that? What happened? Sorry. No, nothing. Okay, it was nothing. Don't worry, Shadow, I'll be back. I'll be fucking back. I don't think anyone is behind this door. Am I- Someone there? Yeah, get the fuck out of my apartment! Do you want to die tonight, Jeremy? What are you? Why are you here? I am vengeance! Hear me roar! To be continued. Alright. Well, that was the end. Uh, I think I did everything. I think? It was just a short little demo to get me more juiced, which it did. I'm super excited now to play this whenever it's out. It's by Dead Dub Productions. I already explained that. <laughs> yeah, by Dead Dub Productions. Awesome, awesome game. I love it so far. And I can't wait to play the full thing. I'm just really excited. I hope everyone else enjoyed and is looking forward to the game. Like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you very much for a thousand again. Goodbye. My name is Jerry Joe. No, Mark! Mark, no! Is someone else dead? I bet someone else is dead. What happened? They didn't listen to me. Where'd they go? The only one of them tried to turn the power back on, but I'm not sure where the rest of them went. I'll go and find them. Just stay here until I come back. Mark wasn't the killer. So the person responsible is still unknown? I'm afraid so. What the hell were you doing?